Hey, what's going on, y'all? Okay, so today I got a fun little lore review video for you. Check this out. It is the Lunker Hunt. It's the Reckless Roach. That's what that says down there. Reckless Roach. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. I'm going to get it out here and show it to y'all. But basically, it is a topwater hollow body roach. So, should work pretty well. Um, we're going to have to look at the legs. And I'm going to have to look and see. I think I brought super glue with me, but we're going to have to look and make sure I have some super glue because I might have to put a little super glue on there. But anyway, yeah, the reckless roach. That's what we're going to be doing today is doing a lure review video of this guy right here. All right, y'all. So first impression of the Lunker Hunt reckless roach. It is a hollow body. Um, <clears throat> the texture seems to be pretty good. Seems like it'll be durable. I'm going to throw it out there and see if this holds up right here this is like where they put the legs on probably should be super gluing that right now but we're gonna see how it holds up but um definitely not gonna the way it is right now I don't think it's gonna come through real thick lily pads but it does have a weight on the bottom if you look right here it's got a belly weight and um, that'll keep it upright so let's try it so let's go for I don't know. I think usually we don't we usually do appearance first. So aesthetically, this thing is really really lifelike. It's um looks like a roach. We definitely have roaches this big here. They try to call them palmetto bugs, but they're roaches. They have uh, like six different colors or something crazy like that. But let's uh try the castability the hooks seem really really sharp on it and they seem like they're placed really really well I mean it's not gonna take much it's not like a frog where you have to bend the hooks back I don't think yet but let's give it a go all right well castability it's good you just fish it like a frog Twitch, twitch, pause. Oh, something's looking on it. Peak the interest of some kind of fish. Okay, so you don't have to jerk it super hard to get it to go. Alright y'all, so I have been pulling it through the lily pads and stuff. I mean, it does, so sometimes it gets on its back. It doesn't take on hardly any water at all. But um, sometimes it does get on its back, but you just got to get it out of the thicker stuff into the open water and just give a little bit of a jerk to it, and um, it'll upright itself. But, yeah, so far, I like it. I haven't been hit yet, but it's not the lure's fault. Oh, there when I hit. Alright y'all. It's time to go try somewhere else and see if we can't catch something on this to test its uh, durability. Alright y'all. I'm obviously back at the truck. Had to get the sun out of my eyes. So one thing that I think I would do is probably take some super glue and see right right there. Put super glue in there. Just keep it all together. I think that little bit of extra weight too would help this lure flip over because that um, belly weight I had to keep pulling it like that to get it to stay straight still got water in it the um, the lure itself is I mean look at it it's super lifelike just a really really cool lure it's 3 8 ounce 2 inches long I think they're only counting for the 2 inches I think they're only counting this but Anyway, really, really cool lure. Durability seems good on it. I wish I would have caught a bass, but one more place I might talk to on this end of stopping. But <laughs> we'll see. But anyway, really cool lure, and I think that once we can catch some bass on it and test its durability, we can go from there and um, 
finish the war review, but for right now, really, really cool. He came up and tried it. All the legs are intact. <laughs> but he did come up and try it. Alright y'all, so what I've noticed is you gotta keep, see the, the belly weight right there? You gotta keep that pulled this way through the hole. That's the way it's designed. And then that way the hook's set right and your weight's right and everything else. Missed another one. Well, I think they're missing me actually. So I, I paused on that one. Give it plenty of time to eat it. Alright y'all, I am back at the truck. Um, that was a pretty good lure. I like it. I think um, I'll probably use that again whenever it's actually topwater season. It's just been getting too cold here at night and you saw like the little ones that were hitting. Um, were real sluggish barely moving and they were little <laughs> but i hope you all enjoyed the video overall i would give that an 8 out of 10 um the durability seemed really good i gotta catch a few uh shell crackers on it and see <laughs> if the durability holds up but the um so far pulling it through lily pads and weeds and everything it held up pretty well but i will catch you all next time make sure you hit the like button down below comment share the video out and uh, make sure you subscribe i'll catch you all next time Take care.